The Dave and Bambi 3.0 mod just dropped and in this video I want to explain the story of the mod and also the backstory of each of the major characters that we get to see. Let's go ahead and start off with the first character we see in the mod named Dave. Now when we're introduced to Dave in this mod, he seems to be grilling sausages and boyfriend and girlfriend just kind of appear behind him. And of course since his boyfriend, he challenges them to a rap battle. Now it seems like everything is okay initially, but at some point it seems that Dave gets a little annoyed and he ends up activating an interdimensional dislocation thing, which basically sends him to like a three dimensional type of world. And in order to get back to the regular universe, Dave is begging boyfriend to actually help him. Now at first I thought the ability to change everything 3D came from the actual suit that Dave is in, aka the chair that he's sitting in, but in actuality it's just an ability that he has. And it may be a reference to the fact that he comes from a game that is actually 3D originally. And for those that I don't know, Dave is definitely fully human, he just has the robotic suit to help him get around because apparently he lost his legs back in an accident in a factory that he used to work in. Now Dave's songs have different endings depending on how well you do, so if you do really well you obviously get the good ending. And the good ending basically just says you help Dave escape the third dimension, in turn Dave gives you and your girlfriend an invitation. Now if you miss too many you'll get the bad ending and it basically just says Dave still gives you the invitation even though he expected more of you. Now if you do really poorly you get this ending here where you see boyfriend actually faints. Now there are a few other endings but these are the major three that I've seen. Next we get to see girlfriend and boyfriend at a farm and it's because the invitation that Dave gave them was for a picnic on this farm. Now it seems that Dave didn't tell Bambi that he was actually inviting people to this picnic so Bambi shows up and he assumes that boyfriend and girlfriend are there to steal corn and if you're familiar with Bambi at all you know that he is completely obsessed with corn. I really like corn. So of course he challenges his boyfriend to a rap battle and if boyfriend loses he'll be banished from the farm. Now the funny thing here is that Dave actually calls Bambi to let him know that he's the one that invited boyfriend and girlfriend to the picnic, but Bambi is so ignorant that he won't even listen to Dave, he literally turns off his phone so he can keep battling boyfriend. And then once he realizes that he's going to lose, he threatens boyfriend by saying that he's going to break his own phone, which is a stupid idea. Girlfriend even acknowledges that it was a stupid idea, because why would they care if you break your own phone? And when girlfriend is calling you stupid, you know you have a problem because boyfriend and girlfriend are definitely not the smartest characters in Friday Night Funkin'. Now eventually Dave does appear on this farm as well and he tells him that the reason that he's so late is because of his son Tristan who is another character that we're going to talk about in a second. But before we move on to Tristan, some fun facts about Bambi include that the farm that he's on right now is actually Zardy's farm. He literally stole it from Zardy. And for those of you that don't know, Zardy is an OG mod character back from when the modding community first really started getting involved in Friday Night Funkin'. Another fact about Bambi is that even though he's technically a human, he also has godlike power, but the reason that he can't access it is because he's too dumb to actually realize how strong he is. Another fact is that even though he looks like a kid, he's actually 36 years old and he was born in Brazil. The next character that we have on the list is Tristan and he's a 9 year old boy and also Dave's adopted son. Now since Dave lives out in the middle of nowhere, Tristan is actually homeschooled by Dave, meaning that he doesn't really get to socialize or be around other kids, and this explains why in the mod Tristan actually takes Bambi's phone and tries to use it. The phone is important to him because he literally gets no contact with people outside of Dave and Bambi of course, but we get to see that Dave is a pretty strict dad here because he yells at his son and makes him give back the phone. In a way I feel kind of bad for Tristan because even though I think Dave is a good dad, since they're out in the middle of nowhere, that phone is the only way that Tristan can actually communicate or be in contact with anybody outside of those two men. Next we're going to start talking about some of the free play slash secret characters starting out with Playbot. Now Playbot is actually a character from Dave's fun algebra class in Dave House which is basically just a mod for the Baldi's basic games. And I know for some people it's hard to tell what she is but she's basically just a grey robot. The next character that we see on our list is called Modi GH and if this sounds familiar to you it's because Modi GH is actually the creator of the mod and every once in a while I think creators just have fun putting themselves into their own mods just for kicks and giggles. The next character that we see on our list is going to be Expunged and a lot of people think that this character is Bambi because he looks a lot like him but that's not actually true. Expunged simply has the ability to take on any appearance that it wants, specifically in the mod it can take any other assets from any other mod character and make it its own or simply erase them or mess with it however he wants to. So in his 3D world he's actually very very powerful. And the only purpose I can see for Expunged as of now is to torture anybody who accidentally enters the 3D world and this is probably why Dave was so adamant on getting out of there so quickly. He knew that if they stayed there too long they would probably be harmed by Expunged. And in case you're wondering, Expunged is definitely more powerful than Dave. 
And a fun fact that I find very interesting is that people notice that Expunge sounds a lot like Bambi, and that's because Expunge doesn't actually have a voice of his own, so he just takes on the voice of whoever's body he's actually mimicking. He's definitely a spooky character, even though he's kind of derpy. The next character we'll talk about is going to be Baldi, who's actually a secret character in the mod, and he appears in the song called Roofs, and he can only be accessed by clicking the hidden Baldi image in Baldi's week. And most of you probably recognize Baldi, he's from the Baldi's basic series, then he's basically the head school teacher of the schoolhouse, giving you math problems or taking you camping and seeming like a normal teacher until you make a mistake and then that's when you get to see his twisted personality. The next character that we have on our list is Recursor and he's in the free play menu and he serves as the main antagonist for this song. Now what's interesting about this character is that it seems to be two characters in one. The first character being this white figure that's kind of obscure while he's kind of framing this black and white figure inside. And apparently this character and song were basically hidden until the mod was released. And the character was meant to be kind of like a joke character that kind of represents what a glitch would look like in a free play song. And I have to admit the design is pretty interesting if nothing else. And the last character that we'll talk about on this list is going to be X Bungo. And he kind of looks a lot like Expunge, but of course his skin is black and he's completely red. And apparently he was another character that wasn't supposed to be in the mod and kind of just got snuck in there. And it seems like Modi didn't want him in the mod at first because he thought the character was ugly, but obviously he got pushed out in the main release. If you enjoyed this video, check out this video on the screen here. Subscribe today to become a member of the Orsforce, and we'll see you tomorrow with another video. Peace, peace.